This video is sponsored by Whitman Chris, the perfect channel for all the creative YouTubers out there. Whether you're looking to build a cigar box guitar or trying to recreate the famous Whitman star hands, Chris has got you covered. Even if you're looking for relaxation music or some inspirational songs, this channel will provide all the things you need to satisfy your needs. Chris also has a collection for sale with his brother Gary, so be sure to check the stories, poetry and songs available on his 47 minute long CD. Please support him because he's supporting me by sponsoring this very video. Thank you. Hi, I'm Brittany Louise Taylor and I watch Ask the Teen on Teen Talks. <laughs> Enjoy! Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Ask the Teen. This week's episode is number 90. I know I've been away for a few weeks, I'm finally back. New episodes, new videos on Saturdays as well. And I know all of you are thinking, maybe it's not showing off on camera though. Uh, look at this, what, what's going on, where have you been? Well I know I said to you originally that I wasn't going on holiday, but I actually did in the end because we managed to find somewhere. I didn't want to tell you guys about it because I was looking for a place to film base chase free. And so I didn't want to mention too much about it until I got back. But uh, now I'm going to be uploading vlogs on the Team 2 every few days. Uh, starting tomorrow and I've got loads of cool vlogs coming your way and you'll know exactly what I got up to so look out for that coming soon but for now on to the questions. So the random pasta asks me if you were a singer what would you call your fans like Lady Gaga's got her little monsters and Katy Perry's got her Katy Cats. Well actually I would probably call my fans if I was still called the teen as a singer I would probably call them uh, the teens team so would that be cool? I don't know maybe that's not that cool but let me know what you think maybe that's what I should call you guys anyway well let me know down there. So Corporal and Mackie asks me, what would you do if aliens invaded Earth and they were friendly, and what would you do if they weren't friendly? Well, if they were friendly, I'd probably ask them how to get back to their planet, just have a look around and stuff. I wouldn't stay there forever, I'd come back, because obviously you'd miss the videos, wouldn't you? Or maybe you wouldn't. But anyway, uh, if they weren't friendly, I'd probably run away, because otherwise I might get killed. What about you guys? Little Miss Commenter asks me, can you, as in me, say tongue twisters such as Unique New York? Well, I just did. Do I have to say it loads of times? Okay. You need New York, you need New York, you need New York. Okay, I wasn't that good. What about, can you guys do, she sells seashells on the she... Sh that wasn't that good at all, was it? She sells seashells... <laughs> really not that good. On to the next question. So I live life to my death asks me, did you go and see uh, The Dark Knight Rises at the cinema? Are you freaking kidding me? Uh, of course I didn't, because I don't like The Dark Knight Rises and Batman and all that kind of stuff. I mean, I do like superheroes, but I don't like Batman that much. Sorry. Roll up to the teen's ice cream van. I've got a dollop of your favourite part of the show or a scoop of the latest gossip. It's the News Talks. This week I've got two things to talk to you about. The first of which is the MTV VMA Awards are fast approaching just a day away now. Uh, that's where all of your favourite videos win awards, or hopefully they win awards if they're really good for the kind of the likes of uh, the best newcomer, the best pop video, the best R&B, all of that stuff. So look out for it on MTV. It's broadcast from America but all around the world as well so look out for that. Uh, that means that your favourites are all up for nominations uh, as I know from obviously the team's top 10. The top nominations this year go to Rihanna and Drake who both have five each and Katy Perry who has four. Also obviously there's lots of controversy around the best newcomer because Kylie Rae Jepsen, The Wanted, One Direction and more are all up for the award but who will get it? You guys got to decide. Side. So did I. I. I voted. Did you? Let me know down there and let's see who wins as soon as I know. I'll let you know in the title up there. So the second thing to talk to you about is the final Celebrity Big Brother UK it takes place on Friday, the day after the awards for MTV VMAs. I haven't been following the show because obviously I've been away, but obviously I don't watch it anyway as I've told you before. Do you watch it? Who's going to win? Who do you like? Who do you not like? I'll let me know down there and then I will let you know up there as soon as I know who wins the show. That's it for this week's edition of the News Talks. If you like the latest information next week or if you know some information let me know down there and I'll get back to you in the next episode. So that's it for now and here it is. It's time for the team's top 10. And now it's time for the team's top 10 where I count down your favourite 10 artists of this week. If you've never voted before and you don't know how to, be sure to check out my poll. If you go below the sponsored information in this very description of this very video, you'll be able to vote and find out if your favourites make the cut next week. But for this week, let's find out where your favourites chart. So at number 10 this week, it's JLS, well done to them. They've announced their new album, their new single, maybe that's why they're doing well. 
Number nine, she's not worth the price tag for number one this week, apparently, it's Jessie J. Number eight, it won't kill her, it's made her stronger, it's Kelly Clarkson. Number seven, ahead of the MTV VMA Awards, it's Justin Bieber. Number six, she's flying that starship still, and it's Nicki Minaj pounding the alarm to the top. Number five, it's Lana Del Rey, well done to her. Number four, it's Katy Perry, she's wide awake, but she wants that number one spot, which is why she's staying awake. Number three this week, it's Cameron Hoskin TV, well done to him, doing well as always. And at number two, it's Outraw, one of your favourite YouTubers, have you not heard of him before, go and check him out. Which means the number one spot is again reserved for Sarah Gibson, F11 bar 84. Well done to her, you guys are loving her and I can see exactly why. Make sure to go and check out her channel, make sure to look at all of our top 10 on Google or on YouTube, wherever you want to check them out. Well done to all of them, make sure to vote next week and now it's time for the shout out. So lots of real entries in the chart this week and two new entries. Well done to everyone that got into the chart. If your favourite's not in, you know what to do. Now before I go, as I said already, I've got time for a shout out. This week it goes to the two Minecraft Dons. You'll hear more about them, or one of them anyway, Primary Gaming 100, who makes up half of the channel uh, on my second channel uh, because he was actually on holiday with me. So you'll find out lots more about him uh, over on my second channel, The Team 2, where I'll be keeping you updated with lots and lots of vlogs from my holiday. And you can see what I got up to because quite a few of you, like Holdsworth Jordan, asked me to upload these videos. So that's what I'm going to do. So thank you for checking out another episode of Ask the Team. If you'd like to check out my links, you know what to do, they're up there. Got my Facebook, The Team Talks. Lots of you checking it out over there and I'm talking to you lots of you over there, which is awesome. Uh, also my Twitter, Greg Frog, and of course my second channel, The Team 2. As I said, it's been redundant recently, but I've got loads of stuff coming for you after my holiday. So go check that out. And I'll see you in the next episode of Ask the Team. Please leave your comments below, your questions below, your shoutouts below. Or send them to me as an inbox message and I'll see you next time. Bye for now, everyone. Bye.